Hi, it's Wayne DeMaine, and welcome to my beer course with Trumpet. Uh, today we're going to be talking about an old school beer, and uh, we're also going to be talking about the Blind Tiger Ale House. Um, so uh, let's talk about the beer first. <laughs> we're going to try a Hercules Double IPA from the Great Divide Brewing in Colorado. Um, now I'm only doing this because uh, over 15 years ago, um, I tried one of these at the Blind Tiger Ale House. Uh, the very first double IPA I ever tried was the Stone Ruination, and I was floored, and it changed the way that I drink beer. Uh, the overhopped uh, double IPA it was a new style 15 years and over again, way back when. Uh, the second double IPA I had also um, was this Hercules Great Divide, um, Hercules Double IPA, and it was uh, a Great Divide event at Blind Tiger Ale House many years ago. We had a bunch of Yetis, and uh, it's a great brewery in Colorado. So what we're going to do now is just go ahead and open this, and I'll keep talking a little bit about the Blind Tiger Ale House as we go along. Um, ooh, whew, I love this beer because it's it's super overhopped. Why am I shaking? I don't know why I'm shaking. Um, I'm It's super overhopped, and look at the copper color on this beer. It is absolutely phenomenal. And growing up as a lover of grapefruits, I've been eating grapefruits my entire life. When I first had this, I was like, holy smokes, how do they get that in a beer? And that's what the double IPA is all about. Mm, and I see I'm getting malt. I'm getting a, there's, there's a lot of malt backbone to this one, too. Mm, grapefruit and oranges in this one. It's time to drink it. Oh, grapefruit madness. Oh my God, I've always liked this beer. This has always been on the top of my list. However, suddenly, I'd say like 10 years ago, the prices for Great Divide beers skyrocketed. And um, Hercules is always in a big 25 ounce bottle. And suddenly it was like $12 or $13 a bottle like 10 years ago. And I was like, whoa, what the hell's up with that? So I haven't had it in a long time. And um, so I was in the Princeton area and there's this amazing uh, liquor store. And uh, and they had this. They had a 12 ounce can. I'm like, holy smokes! And it's been a while since I've had this. Um, but yeah, so um, this is one of the most incredible double IPAs. I mean, look at the color on that thing. It's almost to me, it's 10 percent. It's almost barley wineish, but it's not. It's the alcohol doesn't knock you out. You have to be very careful when you drink these because you know you may not think it's that high in alcohol if you're not paying attention. But it's the same as ruination too. Um, it just seems to be a lot stronger than what they advertise. Although they do advertise this as a 10% beer. Let's do another sip. Awesome. Now, tomorrow, Wednesday, April 19th, the Blind Tiger Ale House is having an event called Lovulo Palooza. And Mike Lovulo is a really good friend of mine. He distributes beers to New York City. He's responsible for bringing some of the wackiest, most rare stuff to New York City. And tomorrow... Uh, that we're having the 6th annual Lavula Peluso at the Blind Tiger Ale House in Greenwich Village on um, on Bleecker Street, right off of Jones, between 7th Avenue. Um, so, go to the Blind Tiger Ale House and look at this list. It is ridiculous. It is sick. I can't wait to try some of the beers on this on this list. It's phenomenal. So, I'm just going to send this out to my, my buddies in the New England craft, uh, whatever you call it. Um, check it out when you get a chance. And uh, it feels great to do a video uh, in the afternoon. Uh-oh, I got to play some trumpet. Whoa, and I, did, I don't even have my trumpet near me. Yes, I do. Here it is. Okay, so name this tune. See if you know this tune. And it's only a bass line. You know that tune? Ha! All right, so you can now get Hercules um, Double IPA in a can uh, for much less than you can in the 25 ounce bottle. Uh, you're gonna love it. It's a phenomenal IPA, and uh, find it. Okay, take care. Bye. It's been fun.